Hey guys, so one of the most commonly asked questions I get for the site is do you really eat all those baked goods that you make for it? And the answer to that is of course, someone's got to taste test it all. So today I'm going to show you exactly what I do eat in a day and how I balance out all of those desserts. So for breakfast I cooked about a half cup of oats and about six berries of any kind you'd like in one cup of boiling water and I let that sit covered until the water is absorbed. I like adding a few berries directly into the oatmeal as it adds a ton of flavor and sweetness. Once that's cooked, I just top it with some hemp seeds, some almond slivers, carob chips, and more fresh berries. This is a sweet and savory breakfast option, which is awesome, and I love how the carob chips just melt directly into the oats. For my first snack, I usually just grab a handful of apple slices and I'll top that with a drizzle of almond butter. It's super filling and really satisfying. If I'm feeling super hungry, I'll add some carob chips and homemade magic shell to make a healthy apple nacho recipe. For lunch today, I made a green smoothie bowl that is so filling you would not believe it. All I did was blend together a banana, about a half a cup of kale, and a half a cup of spinach, and one green apple, and then I topped all of that with some hemp seeds, coconut flakes, almonds livers, blueberries, and kiwi. This is a great way to get a large chunk of your daily greens into your diet without having to make a boring salad. And this smoothie bowl is beyond refreshing and does not taste like a green juice at all, which is a huge plus for me. This afternoon, I was super busy, so just grabbed a handful of cashews for my next snack. For dinner tonight, I made one of my favorite meals, sweet potato tacos. All I did was cook a sweet potato until it's soft and slice it open to resemble a taco shell. And then you just stuff it with the same stuff you'd put in a taco, such as rice, corn, guac, spinach, and I topped it all with some hot sauce. Feel free to add any meat that you'd like or any other vegetable to make this even more indulgent. Saving the best for last, here's where I get to taste test a recipe I've been working on for the site, which is a Pop-Tart mug cake. It takes one minute to make and it is so good. I'll put the recipe link below for you guys in the description. So for me, it works to have a few smaller meals throughout the day instead of three larger ones because I can get pretty hangry at times. Um, but whatever works for you guys, I hope you found this video helpful. Comment below if you want to see more like this or what you do want to see. And don't forget to subscribe. Thanks so much for watching.